here's another Los Angeles Leakers exclusive. Yeah, we are here, man. The L.A. Leakers, Sour Milk, Just Incredible. Yeah. And I think the newest member of the L.A. Leakers. That's what's up. Yeah, I'm on. Um, I'm on. No yeah, question. My, my dude, Nipsey my Hussle. Dude, Nip Hussle. Y'all already know what it is. <laughs> in the house. Neighborhood Nip, man. T- tell America, for those who don't know, I know, like, everybody's been hearing your name everywhere, man. No Blogs, radio, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Artists are on you. Like, you, you have a huge following. Um. What do we got to look forward to, man, with this album? Um, I mean, I'm getting ready to drop this mixtape before the album. It's like a pre, a pre album. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? It's called Bullets Ain't Got No Name Volume Three. And uh, you know, for the people that ain't been following, that's the name of the mixtape series. I got one and two out already. So what I'm gonna do with that is I'm gonna, I'm gonna basically end out that chapter. You know, the Bullets Ain't Got No Names was kind of like me and my element, me in the streets, me submerged in that environment mm-hmm. and, and, and fully all about that and around that you know what I mean so that's gonna be the end of that with this last mixtape it's 22 records all original music wow. you know what I'm saying so it ain't gonna be no jack beats it's gonna be mm-hmm. like another project before the album mm-hmm. and then when I come with the album it's called South Central State of Mind it's just just big records everything huge everything where the West need to be right now to update and that's where cool. hip-hop need to be you know what I'm saying yeah definitely and, and I've heard like two of the joints I think off the mixtape that leaked yeah. or that you leaked out yeah and yeah, but if man, y'all don't got it, man, <laughs> get your fucking music bars up, man. Yeah, yeah, Neighborhood don't, don't Nip. Be late, don't sleep. Y'all had an excuse to sleep on the second. Don't sleep on this last one. It's everywhere. N- okay. Nip's the truth, man. And, and we want to first of all thank you for coming through and hanging nah, with us for you. sure. Thank you. Thank you. You mentioned like the current state of hip hop. Yeah. And I mean, I want I want to get your West Coast take on it, but but on a national level, like where do you feel hip hop's at right now, and where we're going with it, with with your type of music. Um. I feel like I represent the next generation. Like it ain't really my, in my opinion, it ain't really a type of music. Yeah. I represent the youth. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? Like everybody that was successful in hip hop, mm-hmm. that really was doing it, has reached that that point. In my opinion. Yeah. You know, they a lot of them still got life, can still put records out and be successful, but they've reached they 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 plateau. They're not gonna ever be as big as they were. They've reached their highest point in their career. Right, right, right. So I feel like fans know that instinctively. You know what I mean? Because of the, the the way that their music is not still growing or progressing it's kind of like you know phasing into other things rappers is acting yeah transitioning into their corporate state ain't nothing wrong with that that's what the aim is of the game but musically i think people want something that's fresh that's passionate that's you know dudes trying to prove they self dudes that ain't really got platinum records behind them and in millions and millions of records sold so they still hungry and they still got that that fire underneath them i think a lot of the artists got comfortable and they reflect that in their music nips you're on like everyone's like top five right now that's top three you know thank, what i'm saying we, thank you. That's, we, that's a compliment yeah no, no doubt question. no doubt we we like to always ask artists like who, who they're feeling you know what i'm saying yeah. so who's a couple of the people that, that nips is checking for right now whether it's in the ride you're listening to them or you're going to a show and like yeah i'm, I'm messing with them um i mean obviously drake everywhere drake killing the yeah. game right now I, mean, I just really started listening to his, his stuff and i'm impressed I, you know what i mean i like what i hear i feel like dude Definitely a fresh breath of air. Yeah. You know what I mean? Definitely. And got doing something creative and new and innovative. Um, aside from that, you know, I like all the West Coast dudes. Yeah. Not I'm not gonna say I like everybody because I, I ain't gonna lie. Mm-hmm. Musically, I don't like everybody mm-hmm. shit, but I fuck with everybody just cause I respect that grind. No doubt. But I love J- what J Rock doing musically. Yeah. I like what Rocket into Eleven is doing musically. Mm-hmm. Nice. Even glasses, I fuck with glasses music, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? And it's a couple other dudes that ain't really known. Like um, Killer Twan, he from J Rock Hood, he from Bonnie Hunters. Okay. Crazy, you know what I mean? A um, couple other dudes from my area, like Rand Paul, obviously the Slauson Boys, but um, it's not too many people that 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 mu- the music is is, is connecting to me. Gotcha. You yeah. know what I mean? I, I respect everybody grinding and all that, mm-hmm. but I feel like you know everybody need to push their creativity, me included. You know what I mean? Because yeah. the game is changing. So now, now for there's a lot of dudes who who like are out there like really fronting yeah and you being someone who that really grew up in the hood you know like certified you, how, yeah like yeah. D- does that piss you off man when you hear these dudes talking about all this shit on their records and it turned you know what i'm saying I mean, like i just feel sorry for them at the end of the day because it's going to be a point that a point in time when you know what, what was done in the dark come to life mm-hmm. and you're going to have a situation that's awkward or that's hinder your career mm-hmm. or that stop you from eating yeah, 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 you know what I mean. If you're basing everything off your credibility and off your image and what you're supposed to represent, and then if that crumbles, what is the incentive to keep paying attention to you? Even like, it's a lot of examples of that. I ain't gotta say no. <laughs> you know, no disrespect, no shot to anybody. You know, 
I think people can't really even connect to you to that real extent mm -hmm. unless you're being yourself in your music. Unless you're being sincere with what you're saying. Yeah. Like, definitely. you know, you might sell a couple units, you might get some show money, you might have a run, but I don't think people will ever really connect and, and really respect your brand and, mm -hmm. and, and, and buy into it. If yeah, you yeah, like yeah. being sincere in it your Takes music. away from the longevity. Yeah, most definitely. Yeah, no doubt. Right up. So, once again, man, plug the album, plug everything yeah. you got, plug your Twitter, your MySpace. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm on the Twitter every day. I, you already know. Yeah, all the time. Yeah, pay attention. All the time. <laughs> but um, you already know the mixtape coming out. Bullets Ain't Got No Names, Volume 3. It's going to be everywhere. We're doing that with Crooks and Castles. Mm -hmm. Nice. That's going to come out in July. After that, the album coming out December 22nd, South Central State of Mind. It's a West Coast release. New young dude came up without no co-sign, without no major artists endorsing what we doing. We just beat the streets and doing our stuff. So everybody go out and support that. You know, other than that, we everywhere. Slawsonboy.com, NipseyHustle.com, uh, MySpace backslash Nipsey Hustle, Twitter backslash Nipsey Hustle, Facebook. All that power one oh six dot com. That's right, main page. That's right, know. That's you right. Know. All that man. The takeover, tone. baby. Yeah, L.A. Yo, leakers. Make sure you checking us out, man. Every Wednesday night at midnight, power one oh six. You know we got stuff like this, man. Nipsey Hustle come yeah. through, show us love, man. Yeah, L.A. leakers. We are here. That's Shout right. out to Risu okay. dot com, man. The L.A. leakers. We taking over, man. We taking over. Us. Awesome.